debutantes. Uh, sorry I didn't post yesterday. We were out late uh, drinking and I didn't get home till late and I was just too tired to make a video and I'm actually kind of pooped today so we're going to do a super quick um, medicine cabinet. I'm going to go through it, look at all the expired uh, medications and probably clean it out and put it all back. So this may not be the most exciting video but I wanted to have something for you since I skipped a day. I really don't think I'm going to have enough to do a full 31 days um, unless I include my craft room and then that might just be a month on its own. So let's get started on the medicine cabinet. So this is the medicine cabinet in my bathroom. Um, it's right next to the door and I never seem to think there's enough room in the medicine cabinet but um, we'll just see. So this is my medicine cabinet. I probably have lots of stuff that has expired. My son has allergies and he gets colds every once in a while and we always buy something new because we're not 100% sure what we have, which of course is a waste of time and a waste of money. So we're going to just, I'm going to take everything out, put it on the counter, check expiration dates, um, and then put stuff back in and of course clean out the cabinet. Okay, so here is the finished medicine cabinet and you can see it is much cleaner. There's so much more space. Um, I moved the shelves around and I put the smallest space on the top because we don't really use these items very often. So I figured the top shelf would be much better to put them there. I took the shelves out, I wiped everything down, cleaned the shelves, and then started putting stuff back. Um, I put like things with like, like these are all of our cold medicines and these are... Um, like lotions, like uh, Neosporin, Lotrimin, things like that. And if you can tell, I was able to use one of my little candle jars to corral all of my little lotions. And then down here is more first aid type stuff. Tums, of course, is first aid around this house. And I used another candle holder for my band-aids. So right down here is everything that I got rid of. And you can see, um, I eliminated all of those band-aids boxes by using the candle holder and so I got rid of, I gained that much more useful space. And then these were everything that was expired. That Ben Gay was never even opened and it expired like a year ago. So we're getting rid of all of these expired medications. I will probably write down some of the things that we might need like cold medicine um, just so we have it on hand. So that is my completed medicine cabinet super quick purge video so if you liked this short video thumbs it up if you haven't subscribed please do and i will see you all in my next video thanks bye